Hello everyone, happy Sunday. It's Mystery Manny time, so let's pick some polishes. Okay, so our first polish is right here. And this is Revlon Heavenly, and this is a topper. So actually, and I cannot get this opaque on its own, it's a clear jelly base, well, kind of a white, whited clear jelly base. I don't know. Anyways, it's got a bunch of uh, iridescent circle glitters in it. Really pretty. Okay, so because this is a topper, I need to pick two polishes. So let's see what we can get. Ooh. Okay, so that is going to be... Okay, first one, not bad. And that is Polish for Days uh, Harbor Beach. So Polish for Days Harbor Beach. And then that... Oh gosh, I got an icky enough. And then that uh, Revlon Heavenly topper. Okay. All right. Let's see what our third polish, sec technically second polish is going to be. I'm so scared. I don't want to get something that's going to be like totally crazy. Oh my goodness. Okay, here we go. Oh, okay. <laughs> this isn't bad. I can deal with this. This is not bad. Okay. And this is Zoya's Tiana. So Zoya's Tiana, which is a beautiful green polish, and then uh, Polish for Days, Harbor Beach, okay, okay, and then that Iridescent, gorgeous, okay, those are kind of cool, and this is the Revlon, yeah, Revlon Heavenly, hmm, those are actually kind of interesting, wow, okay, all right, not bad. Okay, so those are the three polishes I picked. I will meet you back here with a completed Manny. We'll see what I can come up with. And here's a closer look at the colors. First up, Zoya's Tiana, and this is a pistachio green cream. Then we have Revlon's Heavenly, and this is iridescent flaky suspended in a clear jelly base. And finally, Polish for Days Harbor Beach, and this is a rose gold tinted nail polish with pink, orange, and yellow shifting iridescent shimmer and hollow flakies. So I'm going to start today's Manny off by painting my pinky and index finger in Harbor Beach. Two coats of this is going to provide complete and full coverage, and a lot of that shimmer and sparkle is going to show up beautifully. And now for my ring finger, I'm going to paint this in Zoya's Tiana. This polish is very, very nice. The formula is great. It is almost completely opaque in this first coat. However, I do apply two just to even it out in case there are any uneven or patchy spots that I may have created in the first coat. And finally, for my middle nail, I'm going to be painting one coat of Tees by Revlon Fast Gel. And once that is dry, I'm going to apply a coat of a fast drying top coat here. So then when I do some sponging, it doesn't pick up that white polish underneath. Then I'm applying Moyu London's Cuticle Guard around my nail to help with the cleanup from sponging. And now using a clean makeup sponge, I'm going to apply a strip of Harbor Beach and Tiana. I sponge this on my white nail three times until it reaches the opacity that I want. And then remove that cuticle guard with a pair of tweezers. And now going back to the nail that I painted with Tiana, I'm applying a fast drying top coat to this and then also using that cuticle guard around my nail to help with the cleanup. And again, using a clean makeup sponge, I'm going to apply Heavenly onto this. Now, because Heavenly is a clear jelly base, applying it to the sponge helps the sponge to soak up more of that base, leaving nothing 
but the flakies, which makes for better coverage than just uh, brushing it on. And then just removing that cuticle guard with a pair of tweezers. I then have these really fun uh, cocktail water decals. So I'm gonna put a few of these onto my nails. So the first one here, I put in the water for 30 seconds and it slides right off the backing. I'm gonna apply this to the nail that I did that ombre. Then I decided I wanted to use one of these sayings and this one says, I make poor decisions. I think that's so funny. I'm going to place this on the nail that I painted with Tiana and then sponged over heavenly. Then with a cleanup brush dipped in acetone, I'm going to clean up around my nails that I place these water decals on. And finally, with a coat of Vibrant Vinyl's Fast and Hard Top Coat in Pumpkin Spice Latte, this mani is complete. And here is my final design. I hope you guys enjoyed this. I think this turned out really cute. I absolutely love the sponging of Harbor Beach and Tiana. I think that nail turned out so pretty. It made a beautiful ombre. Please leave any comments or suggestions below and I will see you in the next one.